Hey guys, Brett from Brookview Golf Course and Lawn Bowling. Today we're talking pub curling. We've got four pub curling rinks here at Brookview Golf Course. Anywhere from one to eight people can play on each pub curling rink. Object of the game, each team has four stones, either red or blue. Object of the game is to get all four of your stones closest to the center button than any of the other teams. So flip a coin to determine who goes first, then pretend red goes first. So I grab a red stone. Everybody's gonna deliver from the same spot kind of this middle hash mark right here in the rink. And then we're just gonna simply slide these down the rink, trying to get as close to that center button as we can. We've got a couple stones down there already to speed this up. So here's the first stone. And then blue's gonna go now. You're gonna keep alternating colors until all stones are delivered down to the rink. That one went a little too far. Up red. Blue will be the last stone that gets thrown. It is referred to as a hammer, so now, even that red might have the points, as a blue team, I can go in there and try and push a lot of those red stones out of the way and blow everything up. So only one team will score points. It's whoever's closest to the center button. So right now, the blue team would have one point. So it's one point for blue. The next closest one in is red. That would theoretically stop the scoring. So blue gets one point, red gets zero. The way we score on the scorecard, red would get zero points. Their total is now zero. Blue gets one point. Their total is now over one. Now let's pretend it ended up, we play another end all the way down. And pretend it ends up like this. Red in this case would score two points. So we put two points red, their total is now two. Blue gets zero points since they're not closest. So we put zero, their total remains one. And you play up to 12 ends total.